Hey y'all, Deckermon here, and welcome back to Armored Core 6, Fires of Rubicon. Last time, we took part in Operation Wallbreaker, climbed the wall, took on the Juggernaut, and did a few other little mini-missions in the meantime. It was pretty fun! I had some good times. Now, before we get into the main thing, I got a few things to talk about here. First off, it has come to my attention that in order to fully get the story of this, I'm gonna have to beat it three times. Gonna be a pain, but the second run's not too bad simply because there aren't that many different quests. Third run, however, that's uh, that's where things get interesting. Hmm. Uh, secondly, there are only five chapters in this game, so three runs doesn't seem too bad. And third, I went through and replayed a bunch of the old missions, you know, trying to find treasure chests and such, and it turns out uh, there are none. There are no treasure chests in chapter one. Not a single one. I, I'm actually a little disappointed. <laughs> Though I did get a chance to uh, buy myself quite a bit of new parts, as you can see. My uh, my AC is looking a little speedier. I figured I'd try the fast build this time. Uh, if it doesn't work, I can always go back to the old one. <sighs> and I don't know if there are any other training missions. I think this was literally the last one. My last freebie, and uh, that reminds me, the last thing I want to talk about, From Software did it again. It's in this game. If you know what I'm talking about, you know what I'm talking about. I found it in Elden Ring. Let's see if I can find it in this one. Uh, all right, time for the last mission of Chapter One: Attack the Watchpoint. Oh, and you guys actually finally told me what NT stands for. It's like Muscle Toner or Muscle Tensor or something. It's basically it is what I thought it was. It's basically the mass-produced. Mobile suits. Uh, eliminate the SG squad in the watch point. And destroy the device in the control center at the heart of the complex for 380k. This is a rather personal request from a friend of mine. The spider lady? It concerns a certain facility, a watch point. Once it regulated the underground flow of coral. Now it serves to monitor the dormant veins. I want you to attack it. Why? Your objective will be to destroy the sensor valve at its core. The watch point is kept secure by SG, the planetside PCA force, which means it's too hot for the corporations to be seen there. In other words, we're flying strictly solo on this one. Hmm. Walter, why are we attacking a place that's basically owned by the Planetside Police Force? This seems suicidal. All right, I'll give it a shot here. And apparently this mission is infamous. I don't know why, but we'll find out when we get into it, I'm sure. You'll be going in under cover of darkness. Be ready for anything. <laughs> eh, what have I gotten myself into? Looks like this place is. Time, oh. six, two, one. So looks like this place is built above a iceberg of some kind. Don't worry, not even the PCA would anticipate a solo independent mercenary. Yeah, because no solo independent would be this stupid, right? Get in there and get to work. <sighs> Main system activating combat mode. Wonder if the game wants me to be stealthy. Leave no evidence. If anyone sees you, handle it. Code one five. Intruder sighted. It's it's just one AC. Who are they with? We can look into that later. Engaging. Ah! Wow, that hurt. At fifty percent. Okay, so we've got big heavy cannons. I got to deal with. That sounds like fun. AP. At 30%. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Requesting backup. <sighs> I can't get to the HQ. The cavalry isn't coming. Wipe them out, 621. Two repair kits remaining. <sighs> well, I've got to work through all these damn guns, apparently. AP at 50%. Do 
Anybody else? We good? Somebody's behind me shooting at me. Where? Oh, there you are. Hi. Bye. Confirmed. Enemy squad destroyed. Move on to the next area. <sighs> Man, I'm already down to one repair one kit. Repair kit remaining. So much for being Where did stealthy. Where did come from? What happened to the patrol squad? Code one eight. All units deploy for combat. You're exposed to snipers from all quarters. Keep moving or they'll shoot you down. Yeah, well, this is why I'm over here, out and away from the snipers. Code 31C, we've taken critical damage. Any more? Walter, I still think this is bonkers, man. You see that? That's the Watchpoint's control center. The target's inside. Make your way in. Hang on. I know, like I said, there's no chests here, but I'm just keeping my eyes open just on the off chance. Is that Sula? Pitiful dog. I feel sorry for you. I really do. You may have survived a little longer. If only you had a different master. C1249. Sula. He's an independent mercenary who survived first gen augmentation. Don't think twice, 621. Kill him before he kills you. Yeah, I'm trying here. AP at AP at 30%. He's not making it easy. He's hiding right now. We're 619 and 620. Dead? Which ones did I kill, I wonder? Don't let him bait you. Focus. Where'd he go? You're one of Gen 4's lot. I hear you make fine hounds with the right training. Shame you'll have to die here. AP at... 50%. Oh, damn it. You are tough. Get spiked. Walter, <sighs> stay away from the watch point. Got his combat log. He knew him. And destroy the target. He knew him. And the I love the game said just you know destroy the AC of unknown affiliation. Oh, resupply, thank you. Thank you. I actually needed this, Walter. Alright, I can skip this. It's the same cutscene. There we are. Oh, I needed a resupply after all that. Whoa. Damn! There. Destroy the device in the center. But I want to see what the device in the center is first! I mean, it's... The hell is this? Huh? I don't think this is what they're telling me it is! Really don't. I should leave. I should leave. Good or, job, six two one. Okay. We're done here. Head back to base. The 
this mission was supposed to be a bitch. That was way too easy. Wait, no. Uh. Uh. One. Get out of there. What the hell? Oh my god! I think I just let the fires of Ibis out again, or whatever they were called. The, the fires that burned the planet. Hmm? An older type of augmented human. Fourth generation. Who are you? Have we made contact? I am Air, a Rubiconian. A what? Please, you must wake up. Air? Before your consciousness is forever scattered in the coral flow. Okay, there's some crazy crap going on here. I kind of feel like FromSoft is pulling some near Automata BS. Augmented human C4621. Vital signs confirmed. Hey! Disabling autopilot. I'm alive. Establishing comms link with him. Uh. uh Raven. Hmm? I've identified an approaching enemy. Hi! What? Synchronize with your brainwaves. Nani? And maintain contact to support you. Oh shit. Main system, reactivating combat mode. Oh my god! I've looked into the enemy craft. Ah! It's an autonomous PCA craft, Bounteus. You'll have to break its pulse armor to inflict meaningful damage. Damn, he hits hard! Picking up a massive heat signature. Evasive action, Raven. AP at 30%. Yeah, oh my god, he just wrecked me like it was going out of style. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. I think I found where the bitch is. Alright, I'm gonna swap back to my older setup here because clearly I'm gonna need this. Oh, dude, those missiles are no joke. It's an autonomous PCA craft. Jesus, he hits hard. Yeah, and how do I do that? Picking up a massive heat signature. Evasive action, Raven. Pulse armor oh. down. Now's your chance, Raven. <sighs> ah, he ran away like a little bitch. It's not now difficult. Your comms link offline for now. That massive dose of coral nearly killed you. Please, you have to focus on winning this. God, he gets hard. At thirty percent. The enemy has taken heavy damage. No, he hasn't. He's not even a, not even a third of his way through his life bar. God, dude, he hits like a truck. I can't get through this pulse armor. It's no joke, man. Intensifying. Raven, get clear. Oh god! At 30%. Ah, he staggered me again. What the hell is that? No repair kits remaining. Oh! Oh! Oh, he suddenly changed up. ACS anomaly? What in the hell does that mean? Holy crap! I'm sorry, Raven. Dude, what the hell is with this fight? Okay, I remember reading this description specifically with the pulse gun. Especially suited for canceling out pulse defenses. If I use this, maybe I can actually break his shield a little faster. With any luck. I don't know how good it's going to be at actually denting his armor, though. That's going to be the real trick. With any luck, this will help out. Main system, reactivating combat mode. 
I've looked into the enemy craft. It's an autonomous PCA craft, Bounteus. <laughs> You'll have to break its pulse armor to inflict meaningful damage. That's easier said than done. Oh god, yeah. That's the one that hits like a truck there. Picking up a massive heat signature. Evasive action, Raven. AP at 50%. Jesus, I cannot stay locked onto this guy. Pulse armor down. Now's your chance, Raven. I've taken your comb slink offline for now. That massive dose of coral nearly killed you. Please, you have to focus on winning this. Right hand ammunition at 50%. What, already? AP at 50%. Oh, I gotta get closer before I use this thing. Dude, stop moving! The waves are intensifying. Raven, get clear. Yeah, that was the one. This is where he changes up his pattern. Yeah, that's what it was. Big old flamethrower swords. Right hand and AP at 50%. Come on, take it! God, that one hit. Dude, I cannot see him. This is supposed to be an auto lock, right? There you go. Right hand ammunition at 10%. There we go. The nice. enemy can't take much more. Nor can I. Right hand ammunition depleted. That's not good. That's a bad sound. That's a bad sound. Ah! AP at 50. <laughs> I got him with the sword! <laughs> Woo! That wasn't half bad. Dude, I need more ammo. I need to find something that gives me more ammo capacity. I got it! Enemy systems down. It's silent. Okay. I thought this guy was going to be harder than that. I mean, I died three times to, or is it two or three times? I think it was only two. Hmm. Yeah, this was only my third attempt on this guy. You need rest. And I need to know who you are. But first, a warning. The coral surge you were swept up in? That was just a glimpse. Oh. This warning. Premonition of the storm of flame that will burn Rubicon. Hmm. <laughs> I see the plot is beginning to unfold. Contact. Bonus pay, sweet. Uh, almost paid for the expenses. <laughs> Ooh, detonating bazooka. A friend of mine sent me this observational data. Look, 621. The localized coral explosion caused by the surge has a certain directionality. It's headed straight for the central ice field, across the Alien Ocean. Mm hmm? Like a flock of birds or a school of fish, Coral loves company. Which means, somewhere in the ice field, there's a huge mass of Coral lying dormant. Huh. You said you could hear a strange voice in your head. 
That's a common side effect of old gen augmentation. Wait a minute, I can talk? You guys never talked. Could also be from getting caught in that coral surge. Don't let it bother you. Aw. Whoa. Raven. The coral explosion completely vaporized northwestern Malleus's Bay Area. And even yet, compared to the fires of Ibis, that explosion was hardly a spark. Raven, I have a favor to ask. Let me remain in contact with you until we reach the Coral Convergence. Okay. I have to see where they're taking us. Uh. How this struggle over the Coral ends. I must, as a Rubiconian. Alright. God, I feel like this game needs FF16's active time lore because I have no idea what a Rubicodian even means. Is like, is that just another form of human? Is that something else? Augmented human, C4621, entering standard mode. Two new messages. All right. What do we got? 621, I've got some business to attend to. I need to hog some intel to the corpse and secure a backer for our trip to the ice field. One job for you while I'm out. Rest up. And that's an order. Ah, Walter cares a damn. Barely. Raven. Oh? I see your handlers away on business for now. About that trip to the ice field, we've received a job from Balaam already. Let's take a look, shall we? <laughs> is our is Arya gonna be my new handler while Walter's away? Registration number RB twenty three. Call sign Raven. Your records have been updated. Mm hmm. E rank virtual encounters are now available in the arena. Oh. We invite you to hone your technique. That sounds good. Uh, new merc data added to the arena. Nice. New parts available for purchase. Sheesh, I need more money then. Uh, all right, let me... God damn it, I forgot to save my current AC, so I overrode it by mistake. Well, not by mistake, by the simple fact that I needed to change over, but let me change back and uh, see if I can't make something a little more useful. All right, that's a little better, I think. Back to my speed boost. Uh, I blew all my money on a, a new generator. It, it's heavy as all get out, but this thing has way more power than I really need. All right, let's start looking and see what we need. There's four new E-Ranks that I got to deal with, and these guys all are hoarding OS chips that I want badly. Arena Combat Aptitude Evaluation Program number 26, entering rank E. Mm-hmm. A man's in dual Subject trigger. AC. Dude. Better promise. Call sign, no Zark. That emblem's awesome. I wonder, can... I've seen some pretty That's bonkers custom wish. emblems that people have been posting online. I've seen, Main like, system. the nerve That's symbol from Evangelion, on. Foxhound. Shoot, I've been tempted to download a couple of them because they look so freaking good. All right. Wow, that smarted. The auto lock in this is not good. There we go. He wasn't too tough. Target destroyed. <sighs> All right. Concluding evaluation. Well done. Mm hmm. Thank you. Thank you. I need to get me some uh, OS chips badly because I really want those boosts. Not to mention these are just free cash, basically. And I get his emblem, that's the best part. 
Like, the Raven Emblem is not bad, but I'd rather have a better one. I'll be honest. I really would. Oh, uh, hell. If someone who's really, really good at the uh, Emblem Creator could make an Emblem of the Wartorn Deku Mask, shit, man, send me the code. Send me the code. In a heartbeat, send me that code. Although, to be fair, you have to be playing on PlayStation because the codes are platform exclusive. That's so irritating. Aptitude evaluation program number twenty-five, rank E. <sighs> Double pulse guns. Subject AC infection. Call sign V six Mater Link. That's uh, now not how I was expecting him to pronounce that, but all right. Main system activating combat mode. Where'd you go? Where's my? There you are, you son of a bitch. AP at fifty percent. AP at thirty percent. This one might be a little tougher. God, that thing hits hard. Whatever he's hitting me with, where'd he go? Ah, oh, he got me. Or did I get him? Oh shoot, I got him! I thought he got me for a second. Concluding evaluation. <laughs> that was unpleasantly close. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest. That was unpleasantly close. He was tough. He had a really heavy hitter there. All right, takes care of that. I get his AC data. I get his emblem. I get the OST chips. I got two more of these arenas to do. Little Z. I actually remember taking you on in a prior mission. That's the nice thing about these. Like, some of these are just repeats. Number 24, rank E. Subject AC, UAU. Call sign, Little Z. <laughs> Little Z, dude, she's a beast. Commencing evaluation. Look at that thing. It's a block. Main system, activating combat mode. All right. There we go. There's some real good damage. <sighs> Too far away. Get back here. Where'd you go? Where'd she? There we go. Yeah, that one was much easier. I think it also helped that I can actually see the enemy in here as opposed to the last one. Target black destroyed. on black is mean. Concluding evaluation. Well done. All right, three down, one to go. Look at that. I'm gonna have nine OST chips by the end of this to spend. Sounds like a lot, to be honest. All right. V7 Swinburne. Arena Combat Aptitude Evaluation Program. Number 20. Oh, he's a Tetra. Rank e. Final evaluation. Subject AC. Guidance. Call sign V7 Swinburne. V7 Lobotomy, it looked like. <laughs> All right, my man wants the heavy duty shit. That's fine. He's got a shield. I will break that shield in a heartbeat. Smart it. AP at fifty percent. A 
must have a melee weapon on there. There was some nice damage thrown. Oh god! AP at 30%. Yeah, well his is a lot lower than mine. Oh, so close. There it was. Whoo! What is this elect discharge? Am I getting hit with a status buildup? This concludes E rank evaluation. Well done. Eh, wasn't too bad. You know, every time I look at these legs, I think they're reverse joints, but they're not. Not bad. One minute on the nose. I like that model. And that helped build up a nice itty bitty little nest egg. I can buy a part or two. Incoming comms. Hmm. Congratulating me. Congratulations. Thank you. You have surpassed rank E. We are glad to oversee your development as a mercenary. All mind exists for all mercenaries. <laughs> that could have gone far, far worse. All right, let's see what these new missions are. Oh, just one mission. Infiltrate Grid 086. Here's the request from Balaam Industries. They want you to carry out an advanced survey of the central ice field. To confirm the information Walter brought to them about the coral convergence. Hmm. As for how to cross the Alien Ocean, this is the intercontinental cargo launcher installed on the upper level of grid 086. So big ass cannon. You could use it to launch your AC to the ice field. <laughs> Grid 086 is occupied by the Dozers, outlaws who treat coral like a drug. <laughs> it's also the territory of a belligerent group of arms dealers who call themselves RAD. Be prepared for a perilous journey. Mm. I'll be here to support you, Raven. Well, thank you for that. What this mission is going to do for me besides give me a headache. 160k for this. Need more than that if I want those new legs. Those things are not cheap. I'm fairly adept at analyzing systems. And manipulating them too. Commencing infiltration to grid 086. Creating backdoor into system. Deactivating lock on vertical catapult. Connecting steam cylinders. Launching. <laughs> Whee! Up and up and up we go! Damn. That was dramatic. Let's get to work, shall we? Let's. All right. We are now officially in chapter two, which means I now officially need to keep my eyes open for treasure chests. Activating combat mode. Which means I need to be abusing my scan function as often as possible. Let's head toward the elevator going to the upper level. Oh God. Eh, or we can go to the lower level. That works too. bad they're below me I'll ignore them for now unless there's a treasure chest down there that I'm missing God, there's a lot of you little buggers down here
AP at 50%. <sighs> this little machine gun just does not do enough damage. I, I like it. How? Somebody up there is somebody up there is cruising for a bruising. Come here. <laughs> First time I've actually landed the kick. All right, I think I got everybody. Hopefully, whacking these guys was worth the extra money. Oh, he's a lock hunt. Hope you watch, boss. Leave it to Invincible Rummy to show our guest a good sign. I don't know how invincible you are, buddy. Marina registration found. AC identified as Mad Stomp. Right, dead last. <laughs> Dead last. Oh, well, and now you're just dead. Hostile AC destroyed. <laughs> Looks like you're having fun, Taurus. You know, RAD loves a good welcome party. Come on in and let's get acquainted. How curious. Let's take her up on the offer, Raven. Hmm. I've gathered data on the woman from Anything over here? No. That was Carla, leader of RAD, a formidable dozer faction. She joined them three years ago, bringing with her a crew of junk wizards and hackers. Within half a year, she seized total control and greatly expanded their operations. More? Oh, they're all up top, aren't they? And I cannot land that kick. And that was just completely unnecessary. Keep scanning in the hopes I'll actually find a treasure chest, but uh, so far I haven't seen any yet. the mission marker. I wonder if I, if I scan a chest, will it show up on my little radar at the bottom? That's the question I need answered. Because if that's not the case, then ugh. The scanning thing is nowhere near as powerful as I thought it would be. Right hand ammunition at 30%. That's not a good sound. I'm not wasting my time coming over here. Probably am. Oh, there was one. Hmm. I don't think there was anything over here. Then what's the point of this? It's a lot of open area for nothing then, right? Am I losing my mind? Hmm. Is this just over here to give me more things to kill? More things to kill is nice, you know, money is always fun. But I was kind of hoping for an actual piece of loot, you know? We're on chapter two, you can officially introduce loot to the game. Hmm. So it's gonna be one of those things. Waiting, uh oh. Told you we love a good party. What in the hell are these? Besides dead. Well, you're no 
Nope. Oh, I am gonna need a uh, resupply here soon. Oh, this is not good. My missiles are useless in a section like this. That's all I'm gonna say. That's about the only thing saving my ass right now. Nothing. Oh, hello. Starting to see a couple enemies. AP at 50%. No repair kits remaining. That's fine. They've done their job. Okay. Right hand ammunition at ten percent. Yeah, desperately, desperately need a reload. something, but it's not. Still no treasure chest. Can't get good help these days, can you? Thanks for the checkpoint. Would have been cheaper to just hire you instead. Probably. <laughs> That's gonna be funny. I'm gonna laugh if that's actually an alternate mission in the uh, New Game Plus. It's like, oh yeah, I'm just hire the guy over here. Hi. At least you two, I can just rain the missiles down on your heads. to land out of bounds here. Go AP ahead. At 50%. God, landing out of bounds is hard on your health bar. Where's the other one? That's it. I'm out of bullets for my handgun. And it looks like I came all the way over here for nothing again. Be nice if these, you know, off paths actually meant something. Like, that is starting to become an issue. Like, I'm exploring, I'm looking for these off paths, and I ain't finding squat for them. Right. Could you guys at the very least, you know, <sighs> mark the tr carefully. Yeah, I see the MTs. I'm dealing with them. Nearly forgot your fireworks. Oh, Jesus! That was rude! Interesting. Seems our turret gets a cut above the rest. AP at 30%. Roger. 
right hand ammunition depleted. Yeah, I've noticed. Seems too easy. Let's see what she has up her sleeve. Like, shall we, Raven? I guess. Hmm? Resupply. Oh no. Oh, this is gonna end badly, isn't it? You're giving me a resupply. You like you do not give me resupplies without good reason. You're not afraid of anything, are you? I like that. Oh boy. Oh no! I remember seeing this guy in the gameplay preview. Too bad that this is goodbye. Yep! So it was a trap. The dozers are certainly living up to their reputation. The volcano guy, I remember seeing this one. This was one of like the first bosses they showed up. Ow! Those grinder arms can easily destroy you, I see. Be careful. The smart cleaner. Fifty percent. Yeah, I definitely want to be hitting that top piece. <sighs> He's got so many targets on him. Those big old arms! I think my shit's hitting the ceiling again. Whew. My man's got some tough freaking armor here. I do not know where you want me to hit you. AP at. 50%. Yeah, I getcha. There we are. Oh yeah, there's some good damage. Right in the old freaking furnace. Well, I you were good. But the cleaner is going to have the last laugh. Its behavioral pattern has changed. Watch out. Woo! That's not good. Oh, it's leaving lava pools everywhere. You little bitch. Hey, this guy is a chunky monkey. All right, here, have the good stuff. He took the good stuff and did not care. AP at 50%. He took the good stuff and did not care. Oh, Jesus. Right hand ammunition at 30%. Yeah, I know, and he's over half. His life bar is still over half. <sighs> this might be a job for the bulk eager guy. God, even touching those things. AP at 50, AP at 30%. Okay. Being directly above him, not a good call. Right shoulder ammunition at. 50%. Oh, come on. I can't even touch them now. Right hand ammunition at 10%. Uh. Oh, Jesus. Oh, jeez. Need to stagger my shots here as best I can. And get clipped by the frickin' arms. Not so sharp after all. What a letdown. Dude, that thing is not easy. 
We're uh, we're gonna change back to the the heavier build that I had earlier. All right. Thank goodness for checkpoints. That's all I'm gonna say. Ah! <laughs> the are certainly up to their Move game. Yeah, I'm seeing that still. God, that the problem is just touching those. Not even in the middle of an attack, just brushing those is damaging. I just do not have a good, reliable way of punching through this guy's armor. AP at 50%. I'm already on my second repair kit. I know, I know, I know. AP at 30%. Yeah, I deserved that one. That one I didn't. AP at 50%. I do not know what the game wants from me for this guy. There we go. Side is this mech's nowhere near as maneuverable as the other one was. I can feel it. AP at 30%. Ah, I'm trying, man. Ah, ha, 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 he got me. Not so sharp after all. And this thing's more irritating than the last mech was. The Balteus was nowhere near this problematic. The dozers are certainly living up to their reputation. I'll try something a little heavier this time. Stop hitting me! Stop walking into me! I'm taking freaking walk-in damage. <sighs> it's been hardened with the same steel plating that makes up the grid's floor. There must be a weakness somewhere. Let's find it. Oh, do I have to literally be nailing this? That's a good question. Oh, that's it, isn't it? I think I just figured this out. This isn't about how I hit him, it's about where I hit him. Oh yeah, that's the way. Right down the gullet. That's how we handle this son of a bitch. Good thing all my stuff's vertical. Downside is, I really need the thrust. Maybe I come at this with a tetrapod. stay in the air for very long with these thrusters. That's gonna be a problem. I can't build enough stagger to actually make this count. Ah, armor. AP at 30%. Alright, come on. There we go. Solid hit right down the frickin' gullet. Jesus. AP at 30%. Oh, you are gonna be a tough one, my sir. Come on. Yeah, 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 I know, I know you. I'm not liking this other laser blade I tried too. Yeah, you can have this one, man. 
We're gonna do some, uh, we're gonna do some work back at the garage. Alright, let's try some tetrapod setup. I think this is my problem from last time, is I really need to hit this thing. From above. I can drain the hell down upon you. That's doing good work there. Now we're getting somewhere. Oh, I need to land. It's gonna hurt. Yeah, I knew that was gonna smart. Ah, oh, I ran out of juice at the worst possible time. But it's a, this is the strategy. This is definitely the strategy. Oh, this thing is tough. Jeez. Game, game, you did not want to do what I told you to do at all. Skip that, that. skip that completely. So it was a trap. The dozers are certainly living up to their reputation. I need to get higher. It's some kind of autonomous demolition mech, a rather well equipped one. Charged. <sighs> I'm basically having to use this rifle just to kind of keep the stagger meter from zeroing out. Dude, get out from under there. Say, where's my hover at there, game? Ah. <sighs> Come on. Go down. Son of a bitch. Break cover, recharge energy. Get wrecked. Get utterly wrecked. Oh. What a 
Dude, this thing is a bitch. I almost had him there. I've got the strat now. Sir? Sir, we need to talk about this. Damn, every time I shoot that is right before he dashes. I gotta watch his boosters. Cause that's the that's the hint that he's gonna do that. Please let me move. Stagger going. Right shoulder ammunition at 50%. Yeah, well, thankfully, he's doing a lot better this time. AP at 50%. Come on. Almost got him. Almost got him. One more good stagger should do it. This guy is not easy. Dude, my ammo and repair costs are gonna be through the roof for this one. That's fine, that's fine, this guy is fine. Drop down here for half a sec so I can recharge. AP at 50%. Can't see. Yo, hoo, 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 hoo. dang! That guy was a lot harder than the Balteus. Enemy systems offline. Complete shutdown confirmed. I'm gonna have to save this loadout if I have to do any more big hovers. Enough, Taurus. Been miserable knowing you, but I guess playing nice is a smart choice here. Uh huh. You want to go up top, right? Let me show you the way. Guided tour from Cinder Carla herself. Oh my goodness, that was... That was a friggin' mission, man! That was tough! Yeah. <laughs> my bonus pay was insane! <laughs> uh, weapons destroyed, light MTs, heavies destroyed, special heavy craft destroyed. Yeah, my bonuses were amazing, but my expenses, holy crap! Oh, damn. No new messages. Oh, okay. Y you didn't have to tell me that. Raven, we've received a job from RAD's leader, Karma. The one we just kicked the ass this of. could just be another one of her traps. But after the impression you left on her last time, I think it's unlikely. Let's take a look at the briefing. Hmm. Well, I think I will be saving that for another day because holy cow, I don't know how long this is actually going to be because after all the editing I have to do, but still, this was a good run. <laughs> anyway, if you've enjoyed this, please leave a like and favorite and subscribe to join me for more giant robot action. And as always, I'll see you in the next video.